With the software installation complete and your Bluetooth dongle plugged in and running, we are now ready to configure the hardware for use. Open up the Bullbar 20 program group on your desktop or select it from the start menu if you did not create one. Select configuration. Note that you have two choices, maintain calibrators and maintain QC10 bullbars. There is no option for QC20W because it configures itself automatically. So all you need to set up is your calibrator by clicking option one, maintain calibrators. If you don't have a zero do a calibrator in your kit, there is nothing for you to configure, but you may wish to follow through to familiarize yourself with the process. As this is a new installation, the list is currently empty. So the first thing we need to do is add the details of the calibrator. Start by clicking on the add a calibrator button. Enter the manufacturer's name, in this case Renishaw, select the model, this will be the standard zero do calibrator, then enter the serial number from the label on the top of the calibrator itself. Next, enter the calibration date from the label on the calibrator. You can also add the number of the calibration certificate that came with your calibrator and specify a recalibration interval. Renishaw suggests 12 months, but you can enter any interval depending on the requirements of your organization's quality systems and procedures. Next, you need to enter the values for the nominal and calibrated lengths. Start by adding 100mm nominal and then importing the calibrated length, in this case 99.9979. Click the Add button to save the information in the configuration. Repeat the operation for the 150 and 300mm lengths. Click OK when you are done. If you have a small circle accessory kit with the small 50mm zero do calibrator, you may want to add this now in the same way that you have just added the large calibrator. When you have finished, click the back arrow or home button to return to the configuration screen and close the window.